On September 5th, 1769, James Otis acquired a stout walking stick at a Boston shop. Hearing that his nemesis, Customs Commissioner John Robinson, had purchased a stick at the shop, Otis demanded the fellow of it. The day before, Otis had threatened in an advertisement in the Boston Gazette to break Robinson's head. But that evening, at the Boston Coffee House, when Otis demanded a gentleman's satisfaction of Robinson, it was Otis who had his head split open to the bone. If not for the intercession of John Gridley, who was passing the open door of the Tory Coffee House, Robinson and his friends might have finished Otis off. He survived the attack, but was permanently affected by it. This Day in History brought to you by the Freedom Trail Foundation, partnered with the Massachusetts Teachers Association to bring history to life.